Topping today's health news for you, researchers are expanding an investigation into a newly approved drug shown to benefit patients with mild Alzheimer's or dementia. Now, the AHEAD study is building on the previous Clarity trial into the drug Lecanemab, which we've talked about before. That drug has been proven to reduce brain amyloid plaque, which is a hallmark in Alzheimer's disease. The focus now is to see if Lecanemab can effectively delay or even prevent the symptoms if it started up to 10 years before there's ever any evidence of cognitive impairment. So because we can identify people early who have amyloid in their brain, and because now we have a tool to remove amyloid, the hope is that we can actually prevent uh, symptomatic disease. I'm not doing it for the compensation, which is, you know, minor, but, you know, for some people that would be kind of in interesting. Uh, I'm doing it to, to really help out, and it's one way you can help. If you would like to learn more about qualifications for this AHEAD study and to find the trial site near you, look for this segment in the health section of Local10.com. Meantime, federal health officials are starting to examine possible treatments for long COVID. The National Institutes of Health now says several studies are going to be testing possible therapies for things like brain fog and sleep issues. The trials will include between 300 and 900 participants. Long COVID affects millions of people who were infected with the virus. The condition consists of about 200 different symptoms.